Did you ever get a signal that for a while you thought this is a real deal, like, you know, let's call the White House? Three signals. Three times it's happened. And the, um, the adrenaline rush is unbelievable. It's so unbelievable that I did stupid things. <laughs> I made mistakes in trying to... I could have known, in one case, I could have known that it was really interference a lot sooner than we actually figured it out, but I did something silly. Yeah. Um, yes, only three times, and it really, it really does get us excited. Well, what was the longest uh, period of time that Almost you went... A day. Almost you went a day, a day thinking that you had actually got a, a hold we of real signal. It might, be, it might really be what it was. Part of it was that some of our remote equipment had broken down. We couldn't check it out with that. Um, yeah. Yes, it was exciting. And then... Quite disappointing. Well, yes, yes, except you <laughs> understand. You, you know, you get practice for the real thing as this happens. Um, <laughs> one of the things that happened is that it leaked. We got a call. Oh, 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 the news of it. Leaked. Yes. Um, and so we, we learned a little bit about how hard it is to keep something really important a secret. And who did it leak to the news? Um, yeah, we had a call. Uh, the SETI Institute, Seth said he got a call from the Wall Street Journal, sort of towards the end of this period. And uh, we simply said, we're working on something. We'll get back to you. 